Hey Capricorn, so I'm going to do a little quick reading, um, kind of see what the energy is for the collective. So pretty much everybody, I'm going to try to include everybody in this, but of course it is general, so it's not going to be everybody's story. But first, um, I don't even know why I said that. I need to eat something. Um, <laughs> so yeah, let's see what's going on with you guys. I'm incorporating some new stuff, so I might feel a little off right now, but we're just going to see. So what does Capricorn need to know currently? What is going on with Capricorn? What do they need to know? Um, this could also just be for you specifically, or it could be for you um, or people dealing with you. I mean, what does Capricorn need to know? What is the current energy for the collective of Capricorn? Ooh. Which color is bad? I need to give me a new one. So we have building blocks. This is the one that stayed on the table. You guys are working on yourself. Building blocks to me is like putting things where they fit. Um, a lot of you are trying to heal yourself or work on something within yourself. What fell on the floor is all that glitters. So this card um, basically is like being true to yourself, you know? At the bottom, we have loyal, loyal heart. So I feel Capricorn that you guys are trying to work on yourself. There's nothing wrong with you first off. Let me just tell you that. But with this loyal heart being here, I feel like a lot of you feel that you get mistreated in every aspect of life. I'm sorry, I have just eating peanuts. <laughs> so yeah, you guys feel like you're being disrespected in your love life. You feel like you're being disrespected at work, your personal life. And it's like you can't catch a break because you guys are loyal. You guys want the best for people and they can't seem to do the same for you. So it's like when something bad happens with you guys or you feel down, you have to build yourself back up because you can't rely on other people to do it. What are some of the emotions for Capricorn? My eyes twitching. What are some emotions for some of the Capricorns here in this watching this video? <clears throat> Look. I just said kind that's the kind of heart that capricorns have people think that capricorns are cold um but really capricorns just be watching the scene we don't really like to open up too much to people because we already know like i just said that people will hurt you and you can't rely on other people um so anytime you guys go through something major there's a possibility that you have to rebuild your own self you know make yourself feel better what is the collective energy or emotions for Capricorn? Collective energy of emotions for Capricorn. Mm, don't want to take these. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> no, I'm not taking them. I <laughs> said grumpy. Some of y'all is grumpy. Because those all fell out together. I feel like they weren't shuffled right. Because I thought these cards were bigger. They got you. They got me. I thought they were bigger. All right. Give me the energy of emotions for Capricorn. What is Capricorn feeling right now? Three cards, please. What is Capricorn feeling right now? All right. So we have upset. We have Grumpy, so it came out again. So, like I said, <laughs> that one's meant for you guys. One more card, please, for Capricorn. Their emotions right now. Capricorn. Came out with another one. So we have Special, and we have Helpful. <laughs> that card look cracked out all the time. At the bottom, we have Jealous. So I feel Capricorn that some of you could be jealous, um, but I'm gonna have to say no. I feel like other people could be jealous of you because they don't understand how are you able to compose your emotions so well. We have upset, grumpy, special, and helpful. So I feel like a lot of you are helpful towards others. You're always willing to lend a helpful hand, um, pick up the pieces for someone else. And no one actually puts you first or makes you feel like you're special. It's always about other people. So a lot of you could be empaths as well because it's like you put your own emotions to the side to help other people regardless of how it makes you feel 
um we have grumpy and upset so a lot of you are very irritable right now um you're just tired is what i'm getting so with this grumpiness i feel like a lot of you are tired because it's like the same cycles over and over again and it's like a lot of you want to distance yourself from people and really try to work on what is going to make you happy um this upset card goes along with you feeling like you don't get what you deserve that's really what i'm picking up from from capricorn so let's see what else is going on with capricorn and it just got hot <laughs> i'm using like new everything pretty much except for the oracle cards yeah so what i what i just want to tell you guys don't let your circumstances make you feel like giving up and i'm not talking about in the sense of like death but don't let it keep you from moving forward because there's it's not always going to be like this <laughs> look a child of water came out <sighs> yeah there's a surprise it's not always going to be like this um but this is the child of water this is like the page of cups so yeah there's something that's going to like shock you or just come out the blue um capricorn and you're not going to expect it so even though you might be in this uh funk right now it may be meant for you to go within so that way you can prepare for whatever this is that's coming through um we have father of water in reverse so this is king of cups in reverse we have one of air so this is the ace of swords and then we have two of earth so this is the two of pentacles so yeah somebody from your past um, who hid their emotions from you may be coming back to tell you something so I feel like this might be a surprise to you they may actually be honest um, with this one of air being here they're just going to let it flow it's, for some reason it's just going to come out and I feel like a lot of you are going to be busy doing something some of you could be eating some of you could be doing your homework and it's like something pops up something pops up and you your attention gets move towards what that is so for some of you someone is going to be coming and letting you know something why they were holding back emotionally why they weren't wanting to um solidify anything <clears throat> control so yeah a lot of you um were dealing with someone that tried to control their emotions when it came to you and that's why they played games with you didn't choose you it's like they had all these options or another option that they may have chosen but look we have union so this is basically saying you can't control when union happens i feel like the female here was or the uh, feminine energy is more ascended than the masculine the masculine is looking to the feminine for guidance here and so i feel like a lot of you <clears throat> have been very open with this person and that's what you guys have been doing building yourself up so i feel like everything that's transpired during this time was meant for you guys to actually learn what it is that you want. I'm hearing boundaries and standards. A lot of you are setting boundaries and standards. So whoever comes back, which I feel like somebody from your past could be coming back, they're going to come correct this time because they know you're not paying, playing any games. And I feel like you guys had to let go of controlling when this union would happen or controlling anything pertaining to this situation in order for you to see the truth what else for capricorn with this situation yeah we have the three of swords so some of you were left out you were hurt by this person we have beginnings in reverse you guys were afraid to move on from this individual because i feel like you may have had a strong connection with them but you had to release them you had to go on your own so that way you can actually heal. So a lot of you went through a lot of these emotions, being angry, grumpy, snappy at people, wanting to be special, wanting to be getting attention from anyone, helping others because it made you feel good. And we have this five of swords here. Yeah, so I feel like somebody was trying to um, sell you something that wasn't good. Or someone may be trying to come and sell you something that's not good. So this person may be coming back to tell you something. But a lot of you are going to have your guards up and you're not going to want to trust it. Yeah. Because you feel like this person is, like betrayed you in the past or you feel like they're going to betray you. 
we have fortitude in the reverse. So a lot of you <clears throat> are not as strong during this time because you are going through a lot of different emotions. It's like you're trying to build something back up within yourself. Um, we have the child of air here. So that is the page of swords in reverse. So someone is trying to also, or you guys actually are trying to not put too much into something. You're not trying to find out any information. You just want it to be gone. And then we have the four of fire here. So that's four of wands. So this is more so of like a celebration coming together, enjoying what life has to bring with someone. And then we have illumination and it looks like a masculine. So I feel like there's a masculine that may be coming back um to you capricorn because it's like they realize something but you're gonna have your guard up with this individual because it's like you worked very hard to get where you're at right now and heal yourself from something that they've done in the past or other people and you don't want to ruin that because you do have a loyal heart um capricorns will go to the ends of the earth for people that they love like that's the truth <clears throat> they don't even care I'm not saying you're going to die. I'm not going to say you're going to die to do that. But you guys really would sacrifice for somebody that you care about. You know, my hand is probably like, jacked up. All right, let's see what we got for you guys, Capricorn. You guys got a few extras, I know. All right, so we have V, U. So someone can have those initials or those could be in someone's name. Oops. This could also mean like it's towards the end of something. Because when I think about that, I think about the alphabet. Those letters are towards the end of the alphabet. <clears throat> we have music notes here. I think one's in color and one's not. So yeah, some of you are trying to... Some of you love music. And like I said with this one, the, when I see music notes, someone gets messages through music. And it's like a message for you to really hone in and listen to what is being said. We have strawberries. Some of you need to eat fruit <laughs> or something healthy. Some type of communication here because I see a shell. Someone has love for you. And it's, they can feel it in their soul um, with this shirt with a heart on it. Someone is really feeling this connection that they have towards you. And it's a pull. Someone wants to actually communicate. They think you're a sweet person. They want to tell you some secrets because there's a moon here. Um, you guys have a lot of, you have good luck right now. So things are actually looking up for you. Um, there's a horse. So there's going to definitely be some movement forward. Someone someone is going to explain their emotions. We have a fish here. So it's going to be something um, water, water sign, Pisces. Somebody here really wants to tell you something. Um, we have like high priestess here. It's like palmistry, it looks like. So someone knows that you know. <laughs> it's like you have all the answers. And we have miracle. So if some when I see miracle, something that you never thought was going to happen is going to happen, Capricorn. And I feel like you had to go through these motions in order to get there. Um Yeah, there could be some gift coming in or somebody could be giving you something wrapped wrapped up. Could be flowers. But yeah, we have a miracle. Let's see, I'm doing extra for y'all. People gonna get mad. They're like, uh-uh, you ain't did that for us. <laughs> Let me not look at it. All right, let's see what else we got and I'm gonna be done. All right, we have M as well. So that could be in someone's name. We have miracle here twice. We have stars. So you guys have healed yourself. You focused on healing yourself. A lot of you are abundant, lucky. Um, I said that earlier with the cat. And there's a bunny here. So you guys are definitely lucky. Some of you are getting outside and you're trying to um, exercise or you play sports. <clears throat> Some of you had a dark cloud and you felt like nothing was going to go right. That's probably during your upset and grumpy stage. But here we go with the tree. There's a lot of abundance coming towards you. Some growth. There's an E here too. Oh, I'm sorry, G. So G-M-V-U could be in someone's name. We have a feather here. So this is a divinely guided situation. Um, angelic ancestors, you're being protected. We have fearless. 
And then we have, uh, I'm seeing like materialistic stuff. Some of you guys are purchasing earrings, bags, but it's something to make you feel good. So some of you are um, looking into vanity, maybe trying to get yourself spruced up to make yourself feel better for yourself, not nobody else. Um, we have an elephant here. I forgot what that means, but for me, what I'm taking from this is that you guys appear to be to other people, Capricorns seem to come off as very like scary, but deep down you guys actually are very like loyal, just like the card, loyal heart. You guys have something about you. We have fearless here. Yeah, so you guys go after what it is that you want and you dispose of anything that you don't want. So that is you guys' reading. Um, these charms are going to be something different because I didn't even look through none of them. I just threw them in there. So whatever comes to me is what's going to come out, even if you see something else. Um, but you can <laughs> interpret it. I'm not going to put them on the camera, obviously, because they're too small. And I already, like, dropped the one over here. But yeah, Capricorn, that's you guys' reading um, with some new things that I got here. So definitely let me know if that made any sense to you guys. And I will catch you guys in the next video.